Hey guys, uh, Spikey here for another ranked game. Uh, this one we've got Hospy, or Ho Spy, or however the fuck that's supposed to be pronounced. I've always said it Hospy. I don't know. Against uh, Padman02. Starting with, uh, start with Padman, is that right? Yep. Global chat, as always, um, being annoying. Starting off the Shale Magus. He may be having a, a blood magic type of deck, or he might just be running the unit. Who knows? I'm not sure what Hospi's running. Um, he's got that Doom Ball there with Bounce and Jab, which is that's how I run it. So I mean, it seems like a decent enough choice. There's the Blood Bow going for some range. The hell up. There's the Stoker up there, getting ready to go over to that font. He's one, one AP away. Real close. Now this Doom Ball, it's interesting, he'll be able to threaten this mid font and head for that side font kind of at the same time. Well, I'm not sure if that's what he's planning on doing or if he's planning on just moving it over here to kind of get it in that font or yeah it looks like he's just getting it in that font and he's got his uh, guardian out to protect it so I think Hospi's just playing kind of meta what are you guys alright there's the blood letter going for this font getting uh... what's he got like blood tracker? yeah he's got eviscerated and bloodied that doom ball does oh, there now that has eviscerated and bloodied which means that he can just move in and start blood magicking if he really wanted to like that why? All right. So yeah, that uh, that global chat can shut the fuck up. Um, there needs to at least be some level of option to turn off the flashing, at least when you're in game or something, because. Uh, that's annoying as hell. Uh, anyways, Hospi, uh, moving up with the Doom Ball. Uh, yada yada. Oh, he's got the Shredding Bracelet. Padman threw that on him, which is actually a decent move now, because he's no longer a uh, demon like he was. So he used to heal blood from Blood Balls, but now he doesn't. Apparently interesting stuff is going on in the game between uh, Baller and Sokolov. Interesting. Uh, I kind of wish I'd gotten in to record that game, but that game had already started like a couple minutes before I logged on. Or well, before I started recording at least. So I kind of missed that one. But, uh, anyways, Hospi's got his blood bow over here. And he's starting to kind of move in with his guys. Uh, he's threatening that font over there. Uh, Padman throwing down the Grief Bearer Fountain. As, I guess, partially a uh, font contest and partially to heal that blood bow. And his Doom Ball here is still doing pretty good. I mean, it's it's a little hurt, but it's not too bad. It's got still bodyguarded from the guardian, who's doing fine. What are you guys on about now? Wow, that's uh, some strong language. 
What the fuck, dude? Alright, there's the stoker moving in, grabbing the font. So he's gonna have to make the choice now between double tapping the stoker with the blood bow or smacking it once and taking his font back. Or uh, whatever he might do with the magus. He's kind of baiting him a little bit with that doom ball. And he threw that spell kaiser down to help with that mid font. So there he is. He's just moving on in with that. He should have probably smacked the stoker first with a an attack before moving on in. But, you know, whatever. It's his game. He'll play it how he wants to. Here comes the blood magic turn. Or, well, as much of a blood magic turn as he can do. He only had a little bit of... he only had a few charges. Good lord, yeah. Oh, and there's the bounce. So now he can move in and smack that once. Which will go through and... oh, it'll actually hit him. He must have, uh, dispelled at some point. I must have missed that. Oh, yep. Pure fire. I missed that. I was blind. Anyways, uh, blood letter moving up over there. And he's got his stoker here right up with that blood bow. But that blood bow is still ranged, so, I mean, it's kind of not really a fight that blood bow wants to be in. Because he'll just move right on up and start wailing on that thing. And I mean, he, he can move away a little bit now, but he can't really get far enough away to attack. Especially not still holding that font. And even if he does, he's got his fire attack. He's got a ranged attack that he can throw down. I don't know, he took out that Doom Ball, but he still has that uh, Guardian uh, Blood Bow and Spell Kaiser over here to deal with. And it looks like they're both just playing, uh, what is it, uh, just kind of meta underdeps at the moment. You know, with the, uh, what's it called, just mixed general good stuff. See, he was able to move there, but I mean, he can just swing on over and smack him again. Or he can even fire attack if he wants to, I guess. I mean, he wants to probably close that gap as much as he can. But I mean, he's just, just out of range. For a double tap. I mean, he would need uh, another thing. Oh, there's that Nefari Informant. He's a new guy. He just declared vengeance. And then the Blood Goyle came out. Started wailing on the Blood Letter. Blood Bow, probably gonna smack that real quick. Now you can't really do much with that spell Kaiser. Well, unless he's got Hex, in which case he can do actually quite a bit. He can kill that. But it looks like he does not have Hex. I think it's still on cooldown because he used it on uh, the Magus uh, last turn. See, he can't do anything with that blood bow there other than just keep that font contested. So, I mean, Ospie's just going to kill that next turn, and he'll have that font. And then this blood letter can try and, I guess, wail into this blood coil. 
but I mean he's got scrapper so he's got uh, reflexes three now so I mean he'll only be doing eight you know minus the one or whatever so seven oh FR to the spell Kaiser just made it it's just a meat shield now the best he can do with it is just run it up and make it uh, soak up damage So see, yeah, he was only able to do 16 damage total. But there's all these blood balls around, and he's a demon, so he can just heal up from those. And he's just gonna move over and grab that one. What are you, what are you stupid? Come on now. Interesting. You got Call of the Hunter on that informant, but we'll see. Um, I'm not sure what that animation was. Um, no, really, what what was that? Um, it was besides Hospy winning the game. Uh, it had to have been something. I mean, he used a Mindstorm. Oh well, that's the game anyways. Uh, hope it was uh, mildly enjoyable. Hospy kind of just wrecked him there. But, um, I mean, I guess everyone's just kind of taking their ranks after uh, after the reset, so we'll, we'll have to wait until uh, games between blue people are actually, you know, decent. Uh, in any case, I'll see you next time.